What is up everyone? Say hello YouTube. We are back and we are here with... I'm gonna mute my alerts. We are back. We are here with Hardcore Heroes. Episode number nine. Let's get right into it. Here we go. With only the best and also the worst of the Hardcore Heroes plays. Live. Coming at you live. Here we go. Is he gonna fall down? He's gonna he's gonna miss the elevator and take fall damage and die. Yeah. Yep, yeah, but there's actually a dead body right there. Oh shit. I'm dead. <laughs> he says, How the fuck does someone die here? Oh shit. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, the bodies are just piling up. Let the bodies hit the floor. Jeez. Okay, we're in Thousand Needles. God, that was hard. That was- that's tough. Okay, we're killing the Harpies. We're on a level 35 warrior. His name is dead already. I wonder- I wonder... Amongst all of the hardcore deaths over the last multiple- couple- couple years... What percentage of total hardcore deaths are due to fall damage? Is it 10% are fall damage deaths? Is it 50%? Is it 90% of all hardcore deaths are fall damage deaths? It's a lot. It's a lot. We've just saw two of them. And then the other half are murlocs. It's murlocs and fall damage. All right, Caners, you can do it, man. Come on. We're in Hillsbridge Foothills trying to get murloc heads. Come on. So these oracles, I think they heal. Like they're gonna, they're gonna heal each other. Okay, that one's running. Okay. Oh, you're gonna pull a tide hunter. <sighs> like I said, the other oracle healed that one. He didn't kill it fast enough. We pulled the tide hunter, and now everything is done. Yeah. Okay. Do you have a potion? Listen, you need to not chase that one. You need to run. You need to leave. You need to pop a potion and leave. You need to leave. You have vanish. You have kidney. You have uh. We don't have evasion. There's the health potion. He really wants to kill this guy. Okay, he killed him. You need to run now. Okay. Okay. Okay, he okay, he got he get that oracle is dead. You're stuck in a frost nova. Another tide hunter. Boom, enter another tide hunter. Oh. There's our vanish. This tide hunter was not having that vanish. He gouge vanished. The other one wasn't good enough, and you're gonna die now. You have a, you have another tide. There's a gouge. Oh my god. He pops ev evasion. Just came back up. He sprints. Ooh, this guy is so lucky. Seventy six HP. He makes it out with. You are- and then he stealths. You are so lucky, mister. Oh my god. That, like, he, he should have bailed way sooner. It was greedy to stay in that far, to try to kill those two oracles. That was greed. He greeted it. He greeted it. Now we're killing Eliza on a warrior in Duskwood. Here we go. Now Eliza spawns her, like, skeleton helpers. She's frostbolting. Got you in a Nova, and they're getting frostbolted. There, there are the three skeleton helpers. So, I feel like this guy was not expecting this. I think he, I think he didn't have a plan. I don't think he had a plan. I think he didn't know, he didn't, he didn't know Eliza. He didn't, he doesn't know Eliza like some of us know Eliza. And, uh, you're getting frost bolted, you're perma slowed, the three skeleton ads are on you. You're trying to get rage to Piercing Howl. The Piercing Howl goes out. You got down to 1 HP, by the way. He lives. He lives. He just got the rage for a Piercing Howl. Piercing Howl's boom. We're out. Ooh, that was close. Oh my god. I think he didn't know what happens when you summon Eliza, probably. Okay, we're off the northwest coast of Stranglethorn Vale. We're killing these elite Murlocs. We're trying to get, we're trying to get the Stone of Tides, I think. Oh no, he's trying to get the 10 things from the Murlocs, yeah. 
And disconnected. Okay, if you're in combat and you're holding spacebar swimming up in the water, you will get disconnected. It's like 50-50 chance. You see it all the time. And so he's going to log back in. He might be dead when he logs back in here. Get back in. Come on, come on. Holding spacebar swimming up while in combat underwater equals disconnect. It's bad. Don't do it. And he is on dial-up internet. And we're in. Okay. He's not dead yet. Where's his breath bar? Because we're frost nova for six seconds right now. We try to get one bandage tick. There's the potion. We click the potion. Okay, we got a good kick. So we're, we're still trying to kill this guy. Where is the breath bar? How do I see this guy's breath bar? I'm worried if I can't see the breath bar, then neither can he. <laughs> and if if he can't see the breath bar, then we're in a really bad spot. Uh oh. Okay, we're drowning. Okay, we're drowning. Dude, I love <laughs> I love that that noise is like is like a submarine alarm. It's like you're in a submarine and there's a leak. The submarine is sinking. Eh. <laughs> eh. It sounds like very industrial. Okay. Uh, yep, not good. And you're dead, so that's bad. You guys know, you guys know to to not do the the water combat space bar thing. That's it, it, we've we've seen that happen so many times. It's like a bug. It's stupid, but that's the way it is. <clears throat> We're in a horde player at the ruins of Durnhold Keep, trying to kill these uh, syndicate guys on our shadow priest here. Okay, we're pulling them in. Oh, you have three of them. Oh, you don't want to go that way. Oh, this is very not good. This is a very not good situation. There's our potion. He's holding Psychic Scream. He's trying to mind blast that one. There's the Psychic. The Shadow Bolts are still going out. We try to bandage. He has a poison on him, though. It interrupts the bandage. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. He pulled another one from inside that house. Is there... Is there any... Is there any hope? It's like... It's like everywhere you go, there's just mobs. There's no hope. There is no light at the end of this tunnel. You're just staring down a pitch black tunnel right now. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. He accepted it. He stopped moving. Right now he's he's doing a prayer in real life. His hands are off the keyboard. Embrace it. Embrace it. Yeah, yeah. Accept it. You can also accept in extreme savings when you use promo code hardcore to buy power gum. You can accept the incredible discount that is promo code hardcore, 10% off for power gum, power gum, power gum. Okay, listen. We are doing hardcore Blackrock depths. These mobs are very, very deadly, very deadly and scary. This is one of the reasons why. Holy fuck. Okay, what happened? Two, two pulled, two, in fact. Whoa, whoa, whoa. They're also four manning. They are four manning. Do they have any chance in hell at doing this with a four man? Or are they all going to die? So, like, two or, two or three of these mobs, they bubble. They have a ten second bubble. Oh, 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 the fifth guy dropped. Oh. Oh, my God. Rewind real quick. The fifth guy, Sugar Beer, he sees that, he leaves party, he's out. Sugar Beer was the druid. He's this druid, feral druid. He's gone. Man. Chat, is that toxic? Is it, is it, is it toxic of that guy to do that? Is it toxic of that guy to do that? 
Keep in mind, he didn't do anything wrong. The tank had a bad pull. The tank had a bad pull. That was a bad pull. Lincoln here got us into that situation. I hate to say it. It's true. Sugar dip. Really? 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 I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I need to reinvite. Oh, fuck. That's, I didn't know how that worked, to be honest. Heal me, heal me, heal me. No way you're dead, Baronite. So, the druid is still here. No, the druid left, but is still, like, helping them. That's him there, no doubt. I'm dead, I'm dead. Fearing, fearing, fearing. fearing. Yeah, he just asked for a reinvite. Yeah. Fearing. I don't know where we can run from from here. I'm dead. Dude, you need to, like, sprint back and jump down like you're going to do a lava, like a lava run. That's the only way. You run all the way back, that's the only way out. You jump off the lava, you get to the safety, and you hearth out. That's it. Just keep going. You're dead? Yeah. What the fuck? I went to pull a pack and they ran out, and they ran at me. Just drop. That's all we can do is drop party right now. Does anyone here jump? Do you think anyone here jumps? Would you jump? Would you jump? Because sometimes you'll find a little fire ele elemental down there. You might find a fire Ellie down there, and then you're screwed. No way! No, no! So he's gonna run, he's gonna try to play out the 57 second timer. I think he's gonna die, though. I don't think oh, he's gonna- no. Oh, wow! I I popped everything. He did, he is gonna make it! I popped I'm everything. Out. I'm oh, man! So the Shaman is just dropping uh, Earthbind Totems, and they're just kiting and running. Wow, but one guy died. So, yeah, this is one of the reasons why these mobs are so scary. Let's rewind. These guys come out of the corner. It's bad timing. There are patrol mobs in this entire hallway. They just, like, like, uh, uh, they just, like, like, they aggressively, I can't even talk. They aggressively run around. They, like, run in, in very jerky, aggressive movements, and so that's what you see right here. Oh, oh, back, right? Yeah. Holy fuck, oh, holy fuck. Uh, probably should have shot these guys rather than charge in. I guess, I guess you shoot them and line them in rather than charge in and try to bring them back. That's the play, but... Ooh, rest in peace to the guy that died. That feels fucking bad. Ow. I'm gone. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Feels bad. <laughs> No, All right, he is. No, no, no. Oh no, dude! Oh my God, he took the bait. There was a f alliance. There is an alliance PVP flagged rogue sitting on top of the quest mob, and he runs up and attacks the PVP character. No, 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 no! <laughs> is it? I'm not supposed- that's- you're not supposed to laugh at that. You're not supposed to laugh at that! That's not funny! That's not funny! That's not funny! That's not funny! You can't laugh at that! That's not funny! Ah, <sighs> Peyo. Oh uh, no, so it's... It's relax. Oh, watch out, watch out, Mokati was here. Hold up, rewind. Peyo. Okay, so Peyo- Peyo doesn't charge in here, he... Is it? Peyo's on top of the Grim Totem Raider. And then he runs in, as he's already fighting the Grim Totem Raider, he runs into the Naturalist. Why? No, so it's... It's relaxed. Oh, wh Why did he do that? Why did he do that? Watch out, watch out, Mokati was here. And then this guy pulled those two guys, and then pulled that guy, yeah. Ooh, I'm not <clears> sure here. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Kick I... the heel. Good. Please. I don't think he has retail up right now. Okay, wish me luck. I'm gonna fear here. The fear. Okay, if I'm Peyo, so he chooses to stay here after the fear. Bandage. He's thinking I'm gonna bandage. We got an eight-second fear. I've got a potion still. I'm gonna kill these guys. He's going all in. I think I think you probably need to cut your losses. You need to pop the fear, pot, and run away. You 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 fear potion, nifty stopwatch, run, run. He's committing. He's committing. We did. Okay, the fear aggroed another mob. 
Now we're not looking so hot. There's the potion. Peo is stuck in a 10 second net. He can't move. There is a male dwarf over here who is not helping Peo. He came in to finish his quest. The quest is come up and let the sprites out of the cage. So the dwarf came over here and just opened up the opened up the cage and didn't help Peo. But b by the way, that dwarf has no obligation to help Peo. It's not that dwarf's job to save Peo. It's not. Ooh. Oh man, rest in peace. What are we killing? Damn. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. There was no doubt about that. But now we are in the Serpent Shrine Cavern. Serpent Shrine Cavern? You know what I'm trying to say. The Wailing well, Caverns. First, I think. Actually, we're in the Wailing dude. Caverns. Sleep. Are we are we two manning? Are we two manning? Are we two manning Wailing Caverns? Shaman Warrior? May need to... I'm gonna pop. No, I can heal. He's asleep. He's he's awake now. Are you sure? Yep. I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna heal you. Get him off me. Oh, okay. No, they're they're clinging to life here. Take a pop. Yeah. yeah. It's on you, so Careful. If they yeah. if they backpedal and pull more mobs, them. they're so done. They're so done. Nice interrupt. These guys are actually playing quite well. So far, they're playing quite well. Like they're they're two manning a five man dungeon at at level, so they're definitely in over their head, right? But they're not they're not playing bad. There's the like like ten second sleep. It's out. He broke it. Okay, good. Yeah, kill Pythus. Okay, got the interrupt. Don't have a pot. I feared it. Okay, no problem. Yeah, perfect. Go bandage. You bandage. I can't. Oh! Keep it dead. Oh! 19 HP! 19 HP! I can bandage. Right, you need a bandage. How you need a bandage. How are you full Like, good? I got a pot. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay. We're perfect. Yeah, I got, I, got, uh, I got full health. We're good. Okay, cool. Perfect. Jeez! Jeez! Jesus Christ. Oh! Oh my god, that like that lightning bolt just got off as I like as I shocked him and you were like nice and I was like, it's not nice! <laughs> Harry, watch out! Nice. It's not nice. That was really close. Chat, are you guys two manning hardcore dungeons? Hell no. They are though. They are. Alright. I was actually just doing some of these quests earlier today. We are on a level 21 warrior. We are body diving camps of three mobs. Here we go. We are nuking down the mystic. The problem is the mystic's heal. And so you just saw heal go out. There are two brutes and one mystic. He's, so he's, he's correctly nuking down the one that heals. Good. He's getting pretty low though. He still has a potion. We still have a potion. He tried to click his potion, and he clicked it too late, man. He died. And he died. So we died. We died with a potion. He he blood raged, like, one second before dying also. Man. As a warrior, like, reminder, I guess. As a warrior, you have to play like such a pussy. You really do have to play so safe. Otherwise, one, one, one... One warrior play where you are just a little bit too confident. If you are ever overconfident on a warrior, you're dead. You're guaranteed dead. Also, don't click your potion. Don't click your potion! That potion click killed him. You gotta stay safe. And the best way to stay safe while doing the Hardcore Classic Challenge is if you're chewing power gum and you can get it for 10% off using promo code HARDCORE. Arcadus, the final boss of Old Man. Here we go. Here we go. So those guys are immune to Frost Nova. We have an ice block. 
is everyone inside the room here? I think everyone's inside the room. Chat, what is the approach? Do you kill all of the ads or do you just kind of ignore them while you nuke the boss? Do you nuke boss, ignore ads? Or do you burn the ads and then get back on the boss? What do you do, chat? What's the best way to do this? What's your approach? Nuke boss? The boss is half HP right now. Kinky Blinky, Kinky Binky is at half HP. He's our healer, I believe. Holy Paladin healer. Popping out heals. I think I think these ads are so easy to kill. I think you just probably try to kill the ads. Yeah, you can kill those very easily. Kill those kill those ads. Kill those ads. They don't really have very much HP at all. Like, listen, as a DPS, when you're in this position, if there are like two or three ads, they all have low HP and they're all just like pummeling your healer. Just kill the just kill the ads real quick. Just kill the ads real quick. <clears throat> Just take those guys out. Okay. So what they did was they kind of like brought the ads on top of the melee. And they're just getting kind of cleaved down. Okay, that's probably the way you want to do it. Now, the ads are dead. I think you're going to have more ads soon though. More ads soon. And these ones are elite. These ones actually have a lot of HP. Ooh, people are getting low. This this Holy Paladin is just about Oom um also. You know what I think you do? I think you probably burn that first wave of mini adds down, and then you go all in on boss. Like, you probably don't kill these guys. Now we're nuking boss. The first wave of adds, kill those little micro adds, and then you nuke boss. These guys are just running around. Our mage friend is dead. Level 44. Man, that is depressing. I, w I wonder, they... Like, pr presumably the group went on to kill Akatis without the mage. Do you guys think the remaining four players killed the, killed the boss? Probably. They probably did. They probably did. Jeez, scary, bro. Scary. Did he have anything he could have done? I think, I think, he, I think the mage kind of used everything already. Rip. Rip. They did. Okay. All right. We are like level. We're a level twelve undead warrior at the Scarlet Watch Post in Tiras Fall Glades. Killing level eights. Level eight Scarlet bodyguards. So we charged in there. We've got three of them now. Listen, warriors. Listen, warriors. You cannot be overconfident like this. You see. This is like the th second or third clip where it's a warrior, you see a pack of green mobs, and you're like, oh, they're green. I can go in there, and I can I can 1v3, I can 1v4. Ah. One of them is dead. You've got two left. You already, you already potted. Okay, can you kill this guy? That guy's dead? Why do why are we clicking hamstring? It's on T. Hamstring is is bound to T. Just use this this finger. Go boop. 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 Just like that. Just like that. Frick. But you know what? This mage helped him out. He made it. He made it. Man, I wonder what's going to happen here. Man, I wonder what what possibly could happen right here. Hmm, I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Lost to an elevator. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny every time. It's a classic. It's the Undercity classic is what we call that. Okay, okay, we're working up towards Van Cleef and Deadmines. We're on the side of the boat. We're looking to get Captain Greenskin here. What are we doing? What are we doing? Uh, can't leave combat. Yeah, that's because you're in combat. The reason why you can't leave combat is because you are in combat. One of you pulled something somewhere. You know where you run? You jump on that wheel. Jump on the wheel? No, just go jump on the wheel. Yeah, they pulled everything. Go jump on that wheel right there. That's where you go. You go, boop, jump on the wheel. Because where where else are you going to go? Where else do you go here? This guy knows. He's going up. Target dummy is down. 
Go for the wheel, go for the wheel, go for the wheel, go for the wheel, go for the wheel. He made it. All right. Do we see someone else die, though? We're on the wheel. He made it. That was, he, he got very low. That was a dangerous thing. But he made it. I think, every, I think everyone made it. We have another German. So my 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 video editor is German. And so he has uh, he's always getting the top German hardcore clips. Like half half of our clips are German <laughs> because of, because our video editor is German. <laughs> okay, here we go. <clears throat> oh, we have an elemental invasion. We are in the Winter Spring Lake during the Elemental Invasion. What do you want to bet? He pulls the elite boss and he dies. The elite super boss, like Hydros, whatever her name is. Queen Hydros or whatever. Uh, that's not the boss. That's just one of the elementals. But the elementals are much higher level. So level 58. So that's a problem. He's going to try to kill the ghost here. There's the elite boss. The elite boss is right underneath my webcam. Uh-huh, you just saw her. Okay, we pulled another water elemental. I think our priest friend is out of luck here. You have a you have a psychic scream? There's the psychic. Oh no, you just, Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, don't even listen. If this if this invasion is up, just don't do this quest. Just don't even Ah, <sighs> that was his uh that was his comp. Um, yeah, yeah, just don't even come down here. If you guys see these elementals, just don't even, just don't come down here. Just don't go down there. Level 54 priest, rest in peace. All right, we have Wreck Up here. Wreck Up is actually the world record holder for the smallest user interface uh, of any World of Warcraft player. Look at how small this is. Wow, I have to get out my, my telescope to... Ooh, like like my pirate telescope to see what's going on. Okay, <clears throat> here we go. <laughs> no, it looks clean. It does look clean. True. I just have bad eyes. I think he's gonna fall. He's gonna fall, and uh, he's gonna die. <sighs> Was that a mistake, or did he try to do that? Was that a mistake, or did he try to do that? I think that was a mistake. That that was a mistake. Mm. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that was intentional. That was not intentional. Boys, that is Hardcore Heroes episode number nine. Thank you very much for watching. Can you believe we're already almost up to Hardcore Heroes? Next episode is Hardcore Heroes episode 10. Please, in the description of this video, go check below in the description. We have a link to all of these streamers, all of these YouTubers. You can go show some love to these guys. You should go show some love to these guys. Go subscribe. Go find them. Uh, drop a comment on my video. Subscribe to my channel here. Like. Please like the video if you liked it and if you're enjoying the Hardcore Heroes series. Thank you very much. Go buy some Power Gum. Power Gum. Power Gum. Paragum, paragum. And as always, thank you guys for watching and stay safe.